I'm Wendy Sears, um, toll collector at South Topeka, and I've been with the Turnpike for 40 years. Dana Gonzalez, I'm a purchasing agent for the Turnpike, and I'm on my 39th year. Bruce Winkle, and I've been with the Turnpike for 38 years. I must be the new newbie. Well, the we're <laughs>《Challenges》。I'm sorry. No, you go ahead. Challenges. I, I love a challenge. I'm one of those guys. I like a, the bigger the job, the better. <laughs> and we have got a lot of work to do. That's what I was going to say. You know, so <laughs> that's no, why I, I, that's like, why I said it first. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I like challenges too. I mean, I work with all the departments on equipment buying, who needs what. I work with a lot of vendors that I've got to know over my last 39 years. So met a lot of people. <clears throat> I, I would say my biggest challenge in what I do right now is um, I always try to greet the customer with a smile, no matter what, and um, you don't know what they've gone through when, when they're traveling. I mean, from the south, that, that couple hours is, is kind of a long time, depending on what time of day it is. But if you can greet them with a smile and give them that few seconds while you're doing the transaction, um, that really makes me feel good. You get to start that one. <laughs> when I first started, they were actually the first round of replacing all the bridges. And that was a big deal. I mean, it, we probably spent five or six years replacing the bridges and paving up to them and stuff. And, uh, and then, of course, the barrier wall wasn't too mm -hmm. far after that. That was a big project. I, I stayed in the beginning, and it's still that really that way. It was it's, it was so family oriented? Everybody cared about your family, the group, your bosses and stuff. And it's the like the leave time off was really so easy to take off and go to basketball games or take off and take care of the kids or whatever. It was just so easy to work for. Mm -hmm. I second everything he says, obviously the benefits, the people, the friends, I love my job. The opening of the new 183 Plaza, we, uh, we opened, the, I, I actually remember the night before when there wasn't, you know, it was quiet and I actually went out and this is crazy, but I actually went out. <laughs> laid on top of one of those barriers mm -hmm. up, and I looked up at the stars mm -hmm. and I'm like, it'll never, ever, ever, ever be this quiet. <laughs> and the next day, <laughs> that was gone. I mean, that'll never happen, so. You know, I've made so many friends out here and their family and then they're all leaving. Now we're the old people, aren't yeah. we? Yeah, that's the, We used to be the young people we and now the young. they call me mom. So, you know, when I go or when I, you know, they're just fond memories for me, my friends. Again, I, I can't think of anything particular. There's just so many memories. And as the people that I work with, they, they will attest, I don't mind sharing it with them. I, I do tell a lot of stories, and I have a lot to tell. <laughs> <laughs> Some I can't tell here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we were at the ward yesterday telling one that was pretty good. Yeah. Mm. Kind of get to know somebody. Ask them if, when you greet them in the morning. You know, you know. If, if you ask them how their family is, ask them some. It doesn't have to be a super personal question. You know, just and um, that kind of opens it up that you do care. You care, and then don't hesitate to share a little bit of something of your personal life back. And, uh, I know we like to spend a few minutes in the morning uh, as a crew just to visit about what we've done the night before, what the family's Man, doing. That's good. I mean, that's uh, like what she said. Communicate like you said, that's not necessarily work. At a certain point, it's time to go to work. But, I mean, we're with those people as much or more than we're with our family. We all will say yeah. that. But probably one of my biggest advices to younger people is with the turn bike, you'll get out of it what you put in it. Yeah. You know, it's attitude and 
Have an attitude of gratitude. Yeah, well. That's what Becker's always telling me. Help, <laughs> help, don't hesitate to help somebody. And oh, also, yeah. don't put the chip on your shoulder that you're the one that does it all. Yeah. You know, everybody's a, equal in it. Mm -hmm. and, I, I really haven't made any plans. I know I can, but um, you know, if you like what you're doing, if you love what you're doing, I really do love my job. And um, I'll know when it's time. That's what I figure. I mean, I say I'm ready and I have about a year and a half, but I'll have to see when it gets here. <laughs> I love my job too. Yeah, but I But I also love being at home and yeah, doing I do too. for myself and my mm -hmm. family. So. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Love very you. Much. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Done a lot for me and my family. As much as I want to and are ready to retire, I'm going to miss the turnpike. Oh. I'm going to miss the people. Oh, yeah. I would not have stayed this long if I didn't like my Definitely. job. Definitely. I love my job. I love being outside, I love the challenges. And I am going to miss the people.